in mud. First thing to know, Vic and Trev used to look like this. But now they look like this. Vic, you're a dog? And Mrs. Deer's right, she usually looks like this. Ruby! Come on, Ruby! Come in! But now she looks like Ruby. I mean, I know the weather can change or your luck can change. I hope this lot's luck changes. But for a person to change, I mean, that's a bit suspect. But we are talking about Mrs. Deer's, the evil one. And I got a feeling she'll be changing again soon. Into who or what, don't ask me. Watch the programme. Listen in. Twins aren't supposed to argue. We're not twins! You want onions, Bernard? Hang on a minute, Maureen. Can't you see I'm... Bernard! Yes, I want onions. See, this old lady, Mrs. Deers, she's not really Mrs. Deers, she's... You! At last. The only thing that can destroy me. But I can't destroy it, so let's pretend like a game. It's lost. Time to die. I've told you about mucking about. This is holiday time, not mucking about time. Arr. Don't you erg me, Bernard Shipley. Ow! Oi! Bernard! Bernard! Maureen! Maureen! Quick, Mrs. Stiz, it's a big bloke called Bernard Shipley. Where's the sword? She grabbed it. Come on, run! We must run! Come on! Mr. Big Trav! It's Diaz. Come on! Bernard! Bernard Shipley, you come back here!
It's so depressing. It's big, it's brilliant. Lose yourself in the wonderful world of Botlins. So romantic country music. Yeah. You'll find yours, Miss Dudridge. She'll find her what? Her romance. Everybody finds their romance. Even you. Yeah? Yeah. The question has to be asked, and this reporter's gonna ask it. Does Bill actually want to kiss someone who isn't his mum? Will Bill be kissed back? Does Bill want to be kissed back? Got you! Ah! We'll never find them in these crowds. Come on. Maureen! Maureen! Bernard! Oh, my poor old legs. And I've given me chip. Bernard! Bernard! Oh, excuse me, love. Well, excuse me. I'm trying to find my husband. And I'm trying to find the Connigars. Well, you'll never find anyone in this crowd. If only people would stay still. A good idea. husband look like, love? Big, daft, dopey-looking lad. Very handsome. I'll see what I can do. What does it mean? It's so she can spot us. Come on. the evil one. <laughs> Come here, 
that quite often. No, I'm not doing anything next Tuesday. Yes, I'd love to come out with you. See, I can do it. I'd be good at it. All I need is a live one. Miss Dunneridge. Big, daft, dopey. Definitely. Come on. Got you. song for a beautiful lady. Hit it, boys. A one, a two, a one, two, three, four. Look, Vic, it's that nice collie. Go on, say something nice about us. Oh, grow up. Oh, go on, please. I said, who was it? What? Don't look at me. Look at the size of it. How could I have done that? Come on. Glamorous grand. What? Change? What? You're the evil one, you. The glamorous evil one. Yes, all right, the glamorous evil one. You can take the form of whoever you like. Be whoever you want. So? So become someone young, sporty, athletic. What do you think? Oh, that's good. Looking like that, they'll never think you're Mrs. Tears. Can I be of assistance, mademoiselle? I've hurt my ankle. It's not an ankle. It's a thang of beauty. Where are the others? What? We're supposed to... Have you at your ankle? It is not an ankle. It's a thing of beauty. Come on, come on, Mr. Beck. 
Have you hurt your ankle? It's not an ankle. Apparently, it's a thing of beauty. What's that smell? Oh, uh, la la, I, I'm so sorry, uh, le chien. <laughs> come on, come on, come on, this is dangerous. Uh, you are leaving? You have to. Oh, why so soon? Why so soon? You said we're trying to get away from Miss Dears. Stuff what I said. I can't see Mrs. Dears. Can anyone see Mrs. Dears? We are leaving. Without seeing my performance. Your what? Ah. Uh, um, how you say the entertainer? A little song, a little dance, and a little... Magic! <laughs> I give you the tickets. What sort of song? I bet it's a lovely song. I go, how you say, an un, a deux, an un, deux, trois, quatre. <gasps> Isn't he marvellous? Maybe my pleasure or the price I have to pay. I never really realised how very lovely you are. Oh, Chuck, you make my knees go wobbly. I love you. I love you. I thought I'd lost you. I thought I'd lost you. Let's never lose each other, Bernard. Do you know, romance? It's just a world. Just a world in a dictionary. But now that I see you, romance is a world in my art. I think I'm going to be sick. Take my art. Take my love. Take my heart. <laughs> she made me the face I can't forget. A choice of pleasure or regret. Maybe my pleasure. I think we should go, Miss Dutteridge. I've always run away from men. I'm not running away from this one. But we don't know anything about this man. Might not even be a man. Of course he's a man. He's all man. Are you in love, Miss Dutteridge? Could be dears. Oh, don't be ridiculous! In the measure of day. Ladies and gentlemen, to finish the show, it is time to bring up the ass lights because it is time for magic. Magic? Dears does magic. I will, of course, need the assistance of the most beautiful member of the audience. No, it's Dears. Excuse me. Me and the wife are trying to watch the show. Yes, but you don't understand it. Right here, right now, I will perform a piece of magic never before attempted. <laughs> Is it safe? Trust me, my chérie. No, don't trust him. I warned you. We bid you all a farewell. No! <laughs> Where'd they gone? Follow me. Go on, Nick. No. Here, that's it, don't reach. Just stroll up and say, my mate fancies you. You're like a puppy dog, you, Trev. Oh, please, please, please. All right, all right. Go on, Vic, use your long. Where are they? Who? Oh. Dears. She's changed, hasn't she? Hasn't she? Yeah, she's changed. Didn't I tell you? It's Chevalier. Where has he taken her? Who? Oh. Miss Dudridge. Where does he take a Miss Dutteridge? Now, where? She's in the cinema. Oh, it's so scary. But it's all right. I'm not frightened when I'm with you, Jean-Claude. I, uh, I am not Jean-Claude. What? <laughs> I am not Jean-Claude. What do you mean you're not Jean-Claude? If you're not Jean-Claude, who are you? Uh, you... You may be disappointed. I am... We know who you are! What? Miss Dutteridge! No, it stays here! Uh, I was going to tell her. Oh. Well, you were going to tell me what? I am not Jean-Claude Chevalier. I am, in fact, Brian Bates, a baker from Barnsley. Who? Oh, you see, I always wanted to be an entertainer, but I couldn't get a job as playing Brian Bates from Barnsley, so I changed my name to Jean-Claude Chevalier from France. 
I lied to them, you see, but I didn't want to lie to you because I like you. I like Jean-Claude. Yes, they, they all like Jean-Claude, but I was hoping that for once somebody might just like Brian. Hang on, hang on. So you're not the evil one? No, no, I'm, I'm not the evil one, no. But the dog said she'd changed. So who is Diz? Will you be quiet? I'm trying to watch the film. Where's Diz? Where's Bill? I don't know. I've been hiding in here for the last half hour. You've been what? gasping every time that uh, more mud next week at children's bbc now crystal at tideway says hi to all her friends in 7c1 uh, a ps tell the anorak to get a beard cut well i'll quite happily tell him to get lost if you like <laughs> he wants and uh hopefully he won't be back before the end of the week and finally a joke emailed to us by tim he says what do you call a chicken in a shell suit an egg sadly i think i'm gonna have to bin that one and make way for something just a little bit special